begin today with a big fake ID bust by federal authorities. Dozens of IDs bound for the islands, confiscated. Officials say they were ordered by high school students. Getting busted is bad enough, but officials say these fakes are more dangerous than they seem. Chrissy Tomashiro has a story that's new at 9. Fake IDs from China tucked away in packages bound for Hawaii. That's until Customs and Border Patrol intercepted the package in Chicago. Looking at the, at the IDs, you know, from multiple states, um, some of them even had what looked like, you know, just by glancing at them, the, you know, the, the gold star. Homeland Security investigations discovered dozens of counterfeit driver's licenses ordered by 16 students from two private schools on Oahu. Agents believe the students ordered the fake IDs online, leaving criminals overseas with their sensitive information, including their parents' credit card information to buy the fake IDs. They shared their picture, their actual picture. They shared uh, part of their birth date. They um, shared their signature to be included in these documents. While these fake IDs may have been used to make the teens appear a few years older, officials are concerned criminals could use the information for extortion or ransom. It is available for this company that is producing these IDs to really do whatever they want with their, with their likeness and this uh, personal information. So the message to the public is simple. The less information you put out there, the better. It can protect you, your family, and public safety in the long run. We know fraudsters look for this information, and it may provide uh, one bit of information, and they might be able to, fraudsters might be able to then find other pieces. Christy Tomashiro, K-22 News, working for Hawaii.